something, girl? I'm in section A. What are in section B? I'm looking for fruit. Do you know what type of fruit I'm looking for? Well, but I am looking for good fruit. What type of fruit do you think I'm looking for? Well, I found some fruit. I found a peach, an apple, and blueberry, a big pineapple, and a watermelon too. But these aren't the fruit I'm looking for. Do you know what type of fruit I'm looking for? I'm looking for the fruit straight out of Galatians 5, 22 and 23, which said, But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Against such things there is no law. Amen. I am an inspector holding the fruit inspecting crown. I search for the fruit as I go from town to town. I am inspector holding the fruit inspecting clown and I'm looking for the fruit and every boy and girl today we have a real treat for you I want to introduce the song and present to others put your hands together for my friend Valerie Du Bois Grimes <laughs> Valerie, you've written over 10 books. Talk about some of those books that you have written. Well, well, I want to say hello to everybody out there in TV land. I thank God for this opportunity. I am very grateful for all the books I've written. The total that I have written up to this day is 27. How they all got started was 1992. I was working at my job and I sat down and wrote a poem. And I said, I didn't write this. So I gave it to somebody else to read. And the person read it and said, go get me the person who wrote this. And I said, you're looking at them. They said, no, go get me the person who wrote this. And it was me. And they were like, wow, your gift just blossomed. You know, they, they actually told me, you're a writer because this is awesome. And it was in 20 minutes of sitting in the dining room watching the patients, I wrote this poem. And my first book was Out of the Abundance of the Heart, The Mouth Speaks. Mm -hmm. Valerie, at this time, tell us some of the things that you have done <clears throat> and plan on doing for the future. In time in the career for right now, I'm up to book 21 and I want to go back to the community and reach back. And what I'm getting ready to do now in December coming up in 2015, I want to take two or three people and coach them and take them from manuscript to distribution. Put them on Amazon, I know how to do it. I can put you on Kindle. I know how to get you from manuscript, get your book printed up, like, it would be like these. I can show you how to get an ISBN number, copyright. I can show you how to have a book signing, what to do and what not to do. I done did 15 books. So I done did the bad book signing when nobody showed up, and I can show you the good book signing. <laughs> Everybody come out and you got 25 people in the room buying your book at 15 to 20 dollars a pop. Valerie, last time we talked, you told me about um, a board game that you were interested in. It's the new project of yours. List of questions. It's a number game, it's a word game, and it's to get the husband and wife back communicating, the couple back communicating. What we have lost in marriages is communication. We have we see each other in the morning. Oh, he made my coffee. I gotta get the breakfast. We gotta go pay the bills. We gotta go to work. We gotta come home. So my feet, I'm tired. Rub my back, I'm tired. 
all these things go on from Monday to Sunday. And what we have lost in the marriage is communication. We have lost date night. What happened to date night where you take your mate and take you out on a date? Just you and him or you and her. Amen. We need that back again. And the key to a marriage to stay together and to be able to hold it together is communication. You know, thank God for the kiss and the hug, goodbye and hello, but we need a little bit more than that nowadays because we got a whole lot of stuff going on, but we're not communicating. We're laying in the same bed, but we're not talking. We're driving in the same car, but we're not speaking. So wifey and hubby, we go game would be about an hour to play together, communicating, and I want that to be the icebreaker in a relationship to build them back together. Great. Give them a website, some information where they can reach you. www.enenjoy.com E-A-T-N-Enjoy.com or you can look me up, Missionary Valerie Grimes, on Facebook. Or you can look me up on EatingEnjoyTwitter.com. And the phone number is 646-730-5642. And the name is Valerie. Great. Valerie DeVoy Grimes, everyone. Give her a hand.